Do you ever feel like there's an invisible force dragging you down, preventing you from reaching your full potential and experiencing the joy and fulfillment you deserve? But what if I told you that there's a profound truth about the nature of our existence that can help us break free from these limitations? It's a truth that the teachings of Dolores Cannon beautifully reveal everything in the universe is made up of energy vibrating at different frequencies. From the time EST cells in your body to the grandest thoughts in your mind, it's all energy, and each of these energies carries its own unique vibrational frequency. Now consider this. Our planet Earth is also vibrating, and it's on the cusp of ascending to higher frequency realms. It's a remarkable time in the history of our planet, a time when we have the opportunity to join in this incredible journey. However, there's a catch, and it's akin to remodeling your, your house before you can bring in the new you. You have to let go of the old in the context of our personal vibrations. This means shedding the lower energies that hold us back and prevent us from fully participating in the Earth's ascension. In this video, we'll shine a light on the everyday things we do that unwittingly lower our vibrations, keeping us ted to the old Earth and hindering our progress toward the new. These may seem like simple habits, but their impact on our lives is profound. The truth is we're living in extraordinary times. On one hand, we have made remarkable technological advancements, giving us instant access to an abundance of information. Yet on the other hand, our world is still entangled in conflicts driven by lower instincts and plagued by negativity. This duality underscores the pivotal moment. We find ourselves in a moment of choice, we can either remain in the slow, dualistic third density or ascend alongside our beloved planet to the new Earth. The power to make that choice lies within us, and it starts with understanding the factors that influence our vibrational frequencies. Before we dive into the specific habits that can lower our vibrations, let's take a moment to understand the vibrational universe in which we exist. It's a concept that transforms your perspective on life. Everything around us is energy and it pulsates with its unique frequency. When you grasp this fundamental truth, it can be a game changer in your life. Imagine walking into a room full of people and you can instantly feel the energy. Whether it's uplifting or draining, it's not just a feeling, it's your sensitivity to the energetic vibrations that each person emits. But it's not just people, it's everything. Nature, music, words, thoughts, even the food you consume. So why is it crucial to acknowledge this? Well, because when you start to view the world through the lens of energy, you become a conscious participant in this cosmic dance. You become aware of what uplifts your vibration and what diminishes it. This awareness empowers you to make choices that align with your higher self now. Let's delve deep deeper into the profound concept of multidimensional frequencies. Dolores Cannon's teachings draw a clear distinction between the third dimensional frequency which characterizes the world as we currently perceive it, and the fifth dimensional frequency often referred to as the new earth or the ascended state of consciousness. This understanding can be a guiding light on your journey towards higher vibrations and a more fulfilling life. As humans, we primarily experience the third dimension, which is characterized by duality limitations and a strong sense of separation. In this 3D world, we often encounter fear, ego and materialism. It's like living in a reality where the veil of illusion obscures the deeper truths of existence. But here's the exciting part. We are not confined to this three-day reality. We are multi-dimensional beings with a capacity to expand our consciousness and experience higher dimensions. One of the most profound shifts occurring in our collective journey is the transition towards the fifth dimension, the fifth dimension is a higher vibrational state of consciousness characterized by love, unity and higher awareness. In this dimension, the illusions of separation dissolve 
and a profound sense of interconnectedness prevails, it's a realm where ego takes a back seat and the heart guides our actions. Understanding this transition can help you align with higher vibrations. Another important aspect that we cannot ignore is the power of your mind, because it will allow you to cut yourself off from things that lower your vibration. Your mind is not just an ordinary tool. It's a powerhouse, a key to unlock the door to higher vibrations and a brighter future. As Dolores Cannon emphasized, awareness, intentional focus and free will are the essential ingredients for harnessing the limitless potential of your mind to keep your energy vibrating at a high frequency. First and foremost, awareness is the cornerstone of this journey. It's about becoming conscious of the thoughts, emotions and the energy you radiate. Why is this so important? Because if you're not aware of something, you're essentially powerless to change it. Awareness is the first step towards transformation. It's like turning on a light in a dark room. Suddenly you can see everything clearly. When you become aware of your mental patterns, you gain the ability to cause correct. You can ask yourself, is this fault serving me? Is this emotion uplifting or dragging me down? Awareness allows you to take control of your mental ship. Now let's talk about intentional focus, the second step in this incredible journey of harnessing your mind's power. Once you shower light on your thoughts and emotions, it's time to intentionally guide them. It's like being the director of your own mental movie. You have the script and you can rewrite it as you see fit deliberately. Choose to redirect your thoughts and actions toward positivity and alignment with your goals. Now here's where your power truly shines. Your free will is the, the ultimate gift bestowed upon you. It's the key that unlocks the door to conscious creation. You have the power to choose your thoughts, emotions and actions. You can decide to let go of lower vibrational habits. Those thoughts, emotions and behaviors that no longer serve you you can choose to embrace higher vibrational ones that align with your true self and your deepest desires. Your free will allows you to consciously create the reality you desire. As we come to understand the vibrational nature of our universe, the importance of maintaining a fifth dimensional level of vibration and the power of our minds it is crucial to explore the elements that may be diminishing our vibrational frequency. Here are some factors you should consider removing from your life as they can lower your vibration. One highly processed food. Dolores Cannon emphasized that food carries energy and the energy of what we consume can influence our own energetic vibrations. Just as we are what we eat physically, we're also what we eat energetically. She encouraged us to consider the energy of the food we consume and its impact on our overall well-being. Highly processed foods loaded with artificial additives, preservatives and empty calories are a far cry from the nourishment that our bodies truly crave. Have you ever noticed how different foods make you feel energetically? Some foods may leave you feeling vibrant and alive, while others might make you feel sluggish and tired. What does this tell you about the energy of the food you consume? Everything in the universe vibrates at a certain frequency, including the food we eat. Your body is a temple, and the fuel you put into it plays a vital role in your vibrational frequency. Processed foods are often devoid of the vital life force, energy, present in fresh, natural foods. They can weigh you down physically and energetically. So ask yourself, are you nourishing your body with foods that are alive with nutrients, or are you filling it with dead food that drags you down? Make a conscious choice to prioritize whole, unprocessed foods. Your body and energy will thank you. To dehydration, Dolores Cannon had a profound understanding of the significance of water and hydration in our lives. 
not just for our physical well-being, but also for our vibrational frequency and spiritual growth. Our bodies are primarily composed of water and every cell tissue and all them relies on it to function. Optimally, water, in its purest form, carries a high vibrational frequency. When we consume clean natural water, we're infusing our bodies with that vibrational energy, creating harmony and balance within, in a world filled with sugary beverages, caffeinated drinks and processed foods. Many of us unknowingly deprive our bodies of the water they need. Dehydration doesn't just affect our physical health. It has a significant impact on our mental and emotional well-being. When you're dehydrated, you may experience symptoms like fatigue, irritability, and difficulty concentrating. Your vibrational frequency becomes disrupted and your energy levels plummet. Dolores Cannon encouraged us to recognize the signs of dehydration not just in our bodies but also in our emotional states. She asked how can we maintain a high vibrational frequency if we're depriving our bodies of the very essence of life. Water is natural conductor of energy and has the unique ability to store and transmit energetic information. 3. Cigarettes and alcohol. These substances may provide temporary relief or relaxation, but they come at a steep energetic cost. Smoking and excessive alcohol consumption can cloud your energy field and dull your vibrational frequency. It's like putting a heavy fog over your inner light. Another crucial aspect to consider is the addictive nature of these substances. Contemplate this if you find yourself addicted and without control. You become subservient to them, akin to a form of enslavement. 4. Toxic Household Products Your home should be a sanctuary for your well-being. Toxic cleaning supplies and other household products can introduce harmful chemicals into your living space, affecting not only your physical health, but also your energetic. Balance are you surrounding yourself with toxins that disrupt your harmony. Transition to natural and eco-friendly products to create a more vibrant and energetically clean home. 5. Casual sex and pornography. Intimate connections are powerful exchanges of energy Engaging in casual sexual encounters and consuming explicit content can create energetic teas that drain your vitality. It's worth pondering why many religions and spiritual practices advocate for sexual abstinence. It's not necessarily about prudishness, but rather a deeper understanding of the energetic dynamics involved. Consider this through the act of intimacy. We have the potential to create another life, and at the same time, we exchange energy with our partner. Sometimes these exchanges can occur unintentionally and result in binding energetic connections with others, which can impact our energy levels and well-being. If it's essential to be mindful of the energetic bonds you create through intimate encounters, seek meaningful loving connections that not only honor your physical desires, but also uplift your vibration and nourish your soul. 6. Toxic relationships with energetic vampires. Your relationships can have a profound impact on your vibrational frequency. Unhealthy energy draining connections can weigh you down and hinder your personal growth. Are there people in your life who constantly drain your energy and offer little in return? It may be time to evaluate and distance yourself from such relationships, making space for healthier, more harmonious connections to flourish. 7. Negative Music and Media What you consume through your senses greatly influences your energy, sad and negative music, along with exposure to pessimistic news, and disturbing media can lower your vibrational state. Are you allowing these influences to shape your energy and emotions? Start incorporating more uplifting and positive content into your life. Choose music that uplifts your spirit and limit exposure to negativity in the media. 8. Unfulfilling Job 
Your career is a significant part of your life, and spending most of your waking hours in a job that doesn't align with your passions and purpose can be a major drain on your vibrational frequency. Ask yourself, are you living your purpose and following your heart's desires, or are you stuck in a job that leaves you feeling unfulfilled? Explore opportunities that resonate with your true calling, and watch your vibrational frequency soar as you pursue your passions. 9. Lack of contact with nature. In the hustle and bustle of urban life, it's easy to lose touch with the natural world. However, nature is a powerful source of energy and can help expand your energetic body. Are you spending enough time in nature or are you confined to concrete jungles? Make an effort to reconnect with the earth, whether it's through walks in the park, hikes in the mountains, or simply spending time in your garden. Nature's energy will rejuvenate your spirit and raise your vibration. 10. Lack of rest and overexertion. Your body and energy field require adequate rest to recharge and maintain a high vibrational frequency. Overexerting yourself and not getting enough rest can drastically lower your vibration. Are you pushing yourself to the brink, neglecting the rest? Your body and soul crave, prioritize self-care. Get enough sleep and find balance in your life. When you're well rested, your energy will naturally rise. Understanding that everything in the universe, including ourselves, is made up of energy, vibrating at different frequencies, empowers us to take control of our lives and shape our experiences. Eliminating lower vibrational habits and things from our life is crucial for maintaining a high vibrational frequency. These factors can weigh us down and hinder our progress toward a more vibrant and fulfilling life. We are at a pivotal moment in history where we have the opportunity to join the Earth on its journey toward higher dimensions. To do so, we must shed the lower energies that hold us back and prevent us from fully participating in this incredible transformation. Ultimately, we have the power to choose our vibrational frequency and consciously create the reality we desire by making mindful choices that prioritize our physical, emotional and spiritual well-being, we can raise our vibrational frequency and embrace a brighter future in harmony with the energies of the universe. Keep this in mind and manifest your wishes. Stay blessed.